Hello fellow accountants, welcome to learning at igcseaccounts.com. Please do visit our website at www.igcseaccounts.com. If you go to the notes section you'll find the notes that go along with this tutorial and the easiest way to follow the tutorial is to right click over the button that says notes click here and download it onto your desktop which should be much quicker than waiting for it to load up on your web browser. My name is Dean Alhoss and today we are looking at the double entry system and T accounts. So if you remember the accounting concept of dual aspect suggests that for every debit entry there has to be a credit entry. This system was invented by Luca Pacioli who we have an interesting cartoon of here around 500 years ago and every T account is basically a record of a transaction or a business event that has happened during the financial year. And all these T accounts are recorded in a book which is known as a ledger. Luca Pacioli invented a system which essentially suggested that for every giving effect in a business there had to also be a taking effect. Or in other words, for every debit there had to be a credit of some sort. So the T account, which is sometimes also referred to confusingly as a ledger account, is as the name suggests laid out in the form of a T. At the top you can see the name of the account, which in this case is the cash account. And on the left hand side, you have the symbol DR, which stands for debit in Latin. And on the right hand side, you have the abbreviation, which is CR, and that stands for credit. Inside the T account, you would have the financial currency sign, which for international students would be the dollar, as it's the international currency. And you would, for every transaction, on the left-hand side of the entry, you would write the date, and then the transaction would be recorded, and the number would be put under the dollar sign. Thanks for listening. If you found this tutorial useful, then please do wait up for the next tutorial to load on the playlist. Remember, you can download the past papers and mark schemes as well as the notes and also play on interactive games at our website, which you can find at www.igcseaccounts.com. If you're studying AS level accounts or A2 accounts, then please do visit our sister website at www.alevelaccounts.weebly.com.